Hey everyone, Corey from Corey Reviews back here with yet another Blu-ray Steelbook unboxing. This time it is for the Who Framed Roger Rabbit Zavi exclusive Steelbook. Um, this is for Zavi celebrating uh, two years of exclusive Steelbooks. They already released one edition, which is like the red edition, which I guess came out a few years ago. Instead of this gold border here, it was all red. And now to celebrate two years of them releasing exclusive Steelbooks, they have this gold edition. A lot of people thought it would be like this mustard yellow color, but... It is in fact gold. This set did sell out pretty fast, but uh, they have some uh, leftover copies available now. Um, I believe I got this for around 15 pounds. So it was like 20 some odd dollars shipped. Uh, I think right now it's up to 18 pounds. It's gone up just a little bit. So I'll have a link down below if you want to purchase one of these sets. Uh, it doesn't say how many are available, but I'm guessing it's probably somewhere between two to 3,000 copies. And considering how fast the first one sold out, I wouldn't be surprised if this one officially sells out here pretty soon. But there's the front there. It's pretty much, I think it's the same artwork all around, just different coloring. So, the spine and the back. Special feature wise, you get a digitally restored uh, Roger Rabbit shorts. Who made Roger Rabbit mini documentary? Audio commentary with uh, the filmmakers, a uh, deleted scene. Before and after split screen comparison. Behind the ears, the true story of Roger Rabbit. And on set, Benny the Cab. This set is region free, so it will play in all Blu-ray players worldwide. It has a 1.85 by 1 aspect ratio and a DTS HD Master Audio 5.1 track. And it looks like those are all the subtitles there. A lot of them. And at so the back, you get some images of the film, you know, what the film's about and everything right there. So I'll go ahead and take off the shrink wrap and show you all what's inside. Alright, so the shrink wrap is taken off, and it does have this J-card paper back in here. Slips right off, no glue adhesive or anything. It's one thing I love about UK Steelbooks and Zavi Steelbooks is that they have these that just fit on there very nicely. And here's the Steelbook itself. It's pretty lightweight, it's not as heavy as a lot of other Steelbooks. And there is some embossing there within that border. Actually quite a bit of embossing. Hopefully it's picking up pretty well on camera. and spine and the back and there's even some actually debossing here on the back actually debossing and embossing within that brick border very cool and inside get the one disc region free 25th anniversary which I guess now would probably be the 27th anniversary. And the inside artwork. So I think everything's, like I said, pretty much the same all the way around. Just a different front color and another chance to actually own this film on Steelbook format. Sorry guys, again, I'll have a link for it down below if you want to pick up a copy. Um, it's still available, so I would recommend getting it before it sells out for good. Uh, if you've seen the film, let me know your thoughts of it down below and which edition do you own. So I hope you all enjoy this quick unboxing, and until next time, Corey from Corey Reviews. See you all later.